A major turning point for Tesla. The first Model 3 vehicles are here. But our Leonard Ramirez spoke to one driver who's going to have to wait a year for his new ride. The Model 3 is said to be the Tesla for the masses, but even as the first production Model 3s roll off the Fremont assembly line today, the masses are just going to have to wait. So I'm getting uh, this uh, new model. Vikram Talati put $1,000 down to reserve a Model 3. He just found out he'll get to drive it away in August of 2018. So many people uh, register for it, and his uh, production is still uh, longer to go. This week, Tesla's Elon Musk tweeted that the Model 3 passed regulatory requirements two weeks ahead of schedule and that the first 30 customers would get their cars on July 28th. He predicted production would ramp up to 100 finished cars in August, 1,500 in September, and by December, production should be up to 20,000 Model 3s. The company has orders for 300,000. This is the time to become a big car maker or not. That's all there is to it. CNET analyst Brian Cooley says investors worry whether Tesla can meet those production goals with high quality control. And then there's increasing competition from companies like Volvo, which plans to make only electric and hybrid cars by 2019. Tesla stock rose 45% this year, but has slid 20% since June 26th. Over time, you're going to see a lot of finger drumming on Wall Street saying, OK, guys, let's crank out more cars with fewer people in that square footage. That's a key one on Elon Musk's mind right now. All that doesn't worry Mr. Talati, who's still bullish on the company and his Model 3, which starts at $35,000. Compared to this S model, uh, this one is uh, like uh, almost 50% uh, less price. In San Jose, Len Ramirez, KPIX5.